Uh, but then I open my browser and it's like... Oh, you see that? Ew! Oh, that took forever! I thought, I'm on Linux! I can do whatever I want! Two seconds! Huh? So you make one want to make Firefox start up performance and overall performance as snappier as PewDiePie did. He gave keep that information, but I will not. I will show you how it's done. So it's incredibly easy, just like PewDiePie said. Um, it's incredibly easy to get these results. First of all, don't expect miracles. Of course, if you have a very slow machine to start up, to start, it, this will not make any miracles. But if you have an, a decent SSD and a decent computer like he did, this can actually achieve pretty good results. But test yourself and see if it works. So going exactly to the point, you need to do two things. First, optimize Firefox himself. I'm going to put the link down below on some tips on how to do it. Be careful to, to, to how you do it because some steps might be a little bit uh, over the top for you, but you will feel comfortable do it, do them all or just to the ones where you are, are actually comfortable with. And the second one is using the, pre, the, preload, the preload service. So the preload service, it's been with us for the longest time. It's very easy to install. In my example, I use Ubuntu, or just to apt-get install or apt install uh, preload, pre and you just, it, it just does everything for you. Then you just, I, re I recommend the reboot after that and start fresh. So furthermore, tech savvy, basically the preload, it's a service. It can stop the, ser stop the service, start the service, enable the service, disable the service, all that good stuff. That is just uh, caches or your most frequently app uh, libraries and applications. So things you use more frequently are much more snappier. I'm not saying this is a miracle worker. You need to have a decent base to start off because it's not going to make any miracles. So if you have a, if you have a slow hard drive, this will not make your hard drive faster. It will help, but it will not be so as fast as these examples, mine and PewDiePie's, okay? So if you have a, a, a decent base, a decent PC and a decent SSD, this we can actually improve and make it snappier. I have here a couple of examples. It kind of halved my, my, load, my load times, but my load times to start up were not that bad, like PewDiePie's. Two seconds is not that much. It's just him being him, but... The, the, these two steps, the optimization and the preload service, will actually make it halfway. So it went from, I don't remember exactly, you going, I'm going to put this in the video, but I don't know, two seconds to less than one second. So it was effectively faster, so the results are there. So this is how you can optimize much Firefox to start up quicker. And of course, those uh, optimization steps will affect Firefox only but your preload service will affect the system-wide performance. So if you load, if you use Firefox often, that will preload Firefox and make it snappier. If you, if you load lots of terminal windows or other programs, or, or like LibreOffice or something like of that sort. So preload will make, make applications much snappier, all, all applications, not only Firefox. And of course, in this case, it's Firefox, okay, it, the, the subject. So it went from around two seconds to less than one second. So yes, it has positive effects, but the results may vary. Everyone will have different results. I highly recommend you guys to test it out yourselves. It's very easy to install if you don't like it, and it's very easy to remove if you don't like it. So just try it out. If you have positive results, just keep it up and keep it on and enjoy the process. Like, subscribe and comment. It really helps. And I'll see you in the next one. Cheers, guys. Nani?